everyone, welcome back with our RSPS video today. We're back on Old School RSPS, the biggest Old School Rooms time out there right now. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to continue our lovely grind. I'm very excited. Fast things fast. The giveaway is going to be a 50 double to one lucky winner. All you have to do for that one is like the video, comment, check your names down below, and be subscribed to my channel. If you guys have checked Old School RSPS, make sure to do so. One of the highest quality Old School Rooms based servers out there. And I would say, Let's get right into the video. Today, we're going to continue our lovely adventure grind. I'm very excited. The account is looking very, very neat. We're going to probably get the first 99 skills out of the way right here. I'm definitely going to continue the slay grind as well. Maybe go into some bossing as well and see what else we can do. We're definitely going to be focusing on achievements. We started those on the last episode. That was hella fun as well. So we're definitely going to be continuing those as well. And I would say, first things first, we got to go out and vote. After you guys voted, make sure to go to the vote chest right here. Claim the bat, boy. And then you guys will be getting all your rewards. Here we go. 700k in cash as well as the vote book. I'll definitely take. Over here, guys, we find the vote sort as well. I'm still not too sure what I'm going to be buying. Drop race course is actually very peak because 30 uh, vote points. I might go for that when we go to PV Edmund. But early on, you guys will be buying a bunch of lovely supplies. You can also find the lovely PVM shop in here and a lot of other things. So while finishing dinner, I've just got myself two freaking levels of agility literally for free right here. That's the AFK zone. You guys can get... Uh, agility, rune crafting, mining, as well as fishing, as well as farm, literally for free. So, make sure to take advantage of that one. That's two levels, literally for free. Total level is currently saying at 2025. Next, I'm going to go ahead and do some thiefing. I want to get the 95 out of the way right here. That 93 just looks uh, really odd number. Plus, we're going to get some really nice money that we'll need for the next. 95 thieving is coming in, and that is a beautiful level right here. We've got 300k in cash. I'm going to probably go ahead and get myself 95 crafting next up right here. And probably 90 hair blows, something like that. Let's do it. 95 crafting coming in right here. Cost me quite a bit of money, honestly. Um, But yeah, I'm happy we've got it the way right here. We've lost probably like 500k cash as well. Another 95 out of the way. Next, I'm going to go ahead and do some lovely uh, Slayer. But before we actually go ahead and do this tournament, right here, tournament's actually really, really good and fun. If you win, you can get some really nice rewards on top of that. So let's go ahead and sign up for it. Alrighty, Jays, here we are. Max Strength Tova with a lovely Elder Ball AGS. Let's see if we can do this. Bunch of people in the tiny. Good luck to us. All right, here we are. He has a freaking crazy start right at the bat right here. I hope we can actually just kill him, honestly, quick and easy. Right, why did my spec not go on? 82, what the fuck? Okay, well, I've just got the kill. <laughs> He's literally forward to fuck as well. Um, okay, well, I guess into the next round. All right, boys, got the next fight against Mr. Luke right here. Uh, it's going to be a very interesting fight, honestly, because I think this guy is actually very peed. No, 82 this time, unfortunately, around. Okay, I think I might be dead here, to be honest. Okay, I was so lucky I failed the triple lead right there. Uh, okay, that is a <laughs> very interesting one. I hope I can get a nice combo one board here. With the lovely combo, get the hit. Oh my god, he chanced actually, and I misclicked with the movement there. And we just got killed right here. GG, so Mr. Lee. Regardless, we're going to get our lovely tournament points. I'll take it. Okay, the thing event is happening. Two times multiplying points right now. That means that's the best time to actually get 99 thing out of the way. Let's make some more money, guys. Let's get that 99. There we go, boys. 99 Thief it is coming in. And that is, I think, the first or maybe second skill. Second skill that we've got on. I thought one, actually. Really happy about that one. Absolutely. And we've just made another 670k. Whenever you guys need to make some quick money, definitely go check those out. Next, I'm going to go ahead and do some Slayer because that's also a great money maker. And I want to get it to level, well, 90 is the goal. I'll see you in a bit with the first time. First task, 29 rock slugs. Let's do these. And by the way, you can teleport directly to the task by spending 50k cash, which is a bit pricey, honestly. But you make a lot of money as well, so it's really up to you, boys. I would probably not use it for some easy teleportation tasks. But if it's a bit more complicated, you can teleport through the jam. Alrighty, task completed. We've got ourselves the Slayer Chest Intermediate one that was going to give us probably like 100k. So, power task, roughly 200k. I love we're going to do a bunch of tasks until we're going to get level 90. Let's go for the next one. 22 wall beasts. I have no fucking clue where they're located. Probably it's not easy, but uh, it's probably quite easy. But fuck it, we're just going to teleport there anyway. And so you guys will see the location right here. Whoa, oh, wow, okay. Very interesting. Let's kill. 89 slayers coming in right here. And that wall beast is a uh, freaking hilarious one. Huge hope Mr. Raffles will let me go out and kill it. This is the final kill. After this, we're going to get the next casket and grab the next slayer to back to some rock slug for. Next task, a bunch of infernal mages. Let's get it. Next task, 90 gargoyles. For that, we'll need the hammer. And we are getting close. Well, not close. 360k away from the 90 mark. Probably like another 3-4 tasks. 
Let's get it, boy. Next task, 27 Infernal Mages. Back to back to back, I guess, four times we have the same task. And, uh, yeah, let's do that. Money-wise, we're doing pretty fucking good. And it's actually pretty cool. We're doing Slayer tiles. We're actually getting collection log entries from Hey. So as you can see right here, we have 24 out of 1008, but we've got all these items, I think, for Rome Slayer so far. That's also definitely a cool series when we're going to start grinding towards collection logs, but for now, we need to get that max cape in the jubing. Next stars, 27 lesser demons. Let's do this. 90 slayers coming in right here. Seven and a half. I'm going I'm to complete the task anyway, so we're going to get an extra casket right here. And uh, yeah, that is actually super neat. Another 90 out of the way. After this one, we're going to go for one of those skills right here at the top. When I go towards level 90, that'll be pretty neat, actually. And um, yeah, we still have a boost going on. That's the third one, I believe. So two hours in. Let's go for the fourth lovely vote. Right, there we go. Task completed. Let's open all of them. And that's another 1.1 mil coming in. Another thing that's very P, we've done that in the last episode, complete an achievement which completes skilling tasks. If you guys go and do skilling, go ahead and get them. You're going to get a shit ton of cash completing those tasks right here. So, for example, if we're going to go ahead and do some fishing tasks, I guess, confirm the bad boy. And you guys can see what we have to go ahead and catch the 988 infernal eels. So that's an eight task. And we're going to go ahead and cancel that one. We're going to get one that we want to complete, like a monkfish. 205 Shark sounds quite okay. Probably not the quickest task, but let's go ahead and choke. Is it how much money we're going to make off that lovely... Unfortunately, we'll not be able to do the shark task. I've been testing it for like 15 minutes, and uh, yeah, it is just not worth it because it takes so much longer. The XP is much worse, and with monkfish, that's probably the best way to go for 99. I see a couple of people farming it as well. So we're going to go ahead and do some fishing right here, uh, monkfish wise. And we're going to try to go towards level 85 or even 90. I'll see you in a bit, my G. 85 fishing coming in. Next up, we're going to go ahead and string a lovely magic bow, which is an achievement. So let's go ahead and make that happen. And yes, you guys have to make your bow strings manually right here. So, yep, we've just got the achievement completed to string a magic short bow. Next, we're going to complete the lovely tutorial right here, which I've actually already done. But apparently, we have not completely Complete it in the last episode, so we're going to complete it right now, actually. And there we go. We've completed the Discovery 2 Tours tutorial. You have to do a bunch of activities now here, which is a custom skill called Discovery on Old School. So definitely check it out. It's very neat, and you guys will be able to unlock more stuff for your account. And that's achievement number 18. Next, we're going to buy those uh, goldsmith gauntlets, and we're going to do a gold bar with that one to buy the gauntlets. Uh, you guys have to go into the votes around here, and hopefully I can actually afford them. 12 points, yes, that's more than enough. Very nice thing, we need the cooking gauntlets above another achievement, so we're gonna buy all of them. There we go, achievement number 19 completed. Similar achievement, cook monkfish with the cooking gauntlet has been completed as well. That's number 20. Next, we're gonna do the achievement in the stronghold uh, right here, security one, where we have to go ahead and... Loot the chest in the middle. Let's go ahead and find it. There we go. And we've just got ourselves 100k for that. Well, that's pretty neat. And that's another achievement all the way. 21. I'll definitely take it. I think you can get more rewards in the uh, layers underneath that one. There's, I think, four floors, five floors in total. But we're happy with the achievement completion. What I'm going to do next is I'm going to be unlocking this bad boy right here. Because that's also an achievement, I believe. So we've just unlocked the uh, cannonball one. And we're also going to be unlocking the... Slayer Hunt one, which I think is this one right here, which costs 400 Slayer Points. And we've pretty much invested all our Slayer Points right here. And let's see if that achievement is out of the way. It's actually not. And probably we have to fire a cannonball with that unlockment right here. So that's actually pretty. I've also just purchased all the required items for the Slayer Helm. So let's go ahead and try to get the Black Mask for the end. Hey, there we go. That achievement has been completed. And we are going to try to get our Slayer Mask right here. I'm not sure how many we're going to be killing in total, but I definitely want to get a couple KCs out of the way. And hopefully, we are going to get lucky with the Black Mask, because we've been trying to get this for quite a bit of time now. Let's go, boys. We've just got the Black Mask right here, and I'm so happy about it. Let's freaking go, geez. That is KC 253, and that is absolute nice. Probably a really nice money maker as well. With the cannon, PVM actually goes fairly quick right here. I'm actually glad we've got this out of the way as well. And let's go out and make the lovely stair hammer right here. Boom, chaka, laka. That is a mad freaking upgrade. And I'm so happy about it. Now, as you can see, we can get the imbued version. We can also combine it with uh, other lovely items later on. And yep, this is a massive upgrade coming in for today's episode. And I've just realized that's another collection log entry right here. Absolute name. 
And for the end, I want to get 95 on agility. We're probably going to use the 8th carrier for that one. It's going to take me a minute, but it's going to be so worth it. I've actually tried to check out a couple of rooftops, and the Arden one after level 9 is actually pretty freaking OP. I'm not too sure if that's even better than the Wildy one. But um, yeah, that's the first Mark of Grace coming in as well. It goes direct to the Venture. And the cool thing is you can actually go ahead and get another achievement all the way by purchasing the first lovely um, Graceful piece, which we're probably going to do in the next episode. Unless we're going to get a bunch of them within those two levels. Right, there we go, boys. Probably like 15 runs later. We've uh, completed that one. We've got 14 more sprays as well, which is actually pretty fucking lit. And uh, yeah, I think that's a perfect wrap for this brand new episode right here. Total level is currently at 2,050 almost. That's absolutely neat. We're getting closer and closer towards the lovely comp cape. A bunch of lovely achievements out of the way as well. And the adventures continue. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, would like to check out Old School, make sure to do so. The links are down below. Don't forget to enter the giveaway by smashing the like button, commenting in your names down below, and be subscribed to my channel. I'll see you guys all online. Have a good one and peace out.